Time to be messing around in some more vampire survivors as Mina Minara taking on the old Abyss Fuscari with the Boogaloo of Illusions. No failures, just failure to switch it down to two weapons. Gotta compensate for that dang Vento Sacro. Wow. And there it is. And with my weapon slots taken care of, it's time for the passive slots. Whoever could have guessed that this would go very quickly. Alright, and with randomizing stats... Who knows what will await Minna later. Because I sure have no idea what I'm going to pick for my third weapon. As I said, anything that fuses together will be counted against it. But the weapon pickup will not. Not that I'm going to be getting the weapon pickup, probably. Let's get that third one early. Just to show off what it can do. Whatever it does. Whatever other arcana I'm getting, because what do I need besides Boogaloo of Illusion? Nothing. You don't need anything but Boogaloo of Illusion. Okay, may as well... Oh, wow, that's doing a lot of damage. Um. I don't think we get this card, Silver Ring. All you need is a little bit of space, and then bam, all good. That empty tome is looking dangerous, maxed out as it is, with Sign Old Sanctuary to help it. Whoever could have guessed that was going to happen. Get that itty bitty might up. Endless whipping. Oh yeah. Though it will not be endless whipping for long with how Mina's random, random stats work. Oh, man. Actually, I need to stop. Wait, no. I do. I can get to Walla Walla right now. As long as I can get over there. Dang you, slow Atlanteans. Walfu Walu, Beaver Power Go. Now I get another weapon. What will it be? Wow, it's so tiny now. And I've got Boogaloo Boost in it. Good go spread shot again. Look at them tiny shots. Pew 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 pew. Oh wow, I got to you so early that you're dying fast. Yay, golden eggs. Banish thee to the abyss, Torona's box. Well, this is the abyss, so I'm banishing you back home. Oh yeah. Guess I should stay still till I see another evolution or a chest. All chests evolve here on Abyss Foscari. Yay, early evolutions. Okay, one more level. Let's try not to get anything excessive. Alrighty. And prototype C at the 539 mark. Nice. Well, Pierce is just Pierce, so... Oh, three Pierce away. Right away. <laughs> Look at them big old spread shot bullets. And they're pretty dang slow, too. That's the power of random randomness. Well, not random's randomness, but Minra's randomness. Wow, four Pierce already? Nothing's getting through that. Well, I suppose 
I'll just keep jacking up the area and say this is the biggest spread gun shots. Oh, a crown. I almost hit a crown. Yeah, it's already, what, four area? That's another candelabra door level. Imagine how big they'd be if I had the... Silver ring instead of the empty tomb. Or silver ring just by itself. That won't... It can't be anything. Oh, now they're firing super fast, but they're pretty small. Definitely. This... The... Spread gun into Prototype C is probably the... Wow. It's probably... The one that has the most consistent... Gee, that's so much pierce. Most consistent power scaling. Everything else has a... You know, maybe we get a strong evolution with a weak base. This one is strong in both its forms. Really shouldn't be gaining this much area. I need might. Those final waves are still going to be the final waves. And I don't think Minna's going to have the power to take care of it. Still, look at how big them are. bullets are. Those spread shots are. Well, on the other hand, it is an inverse, so... That's also a thing. Man, it's nice being able to see where you can go, right? Oh, Genevieve. Evil our vision. Wait, why is my... Da, da, da. Between the double scaling, the size of this gets actually fairly ridiculous. Oh, so silly. Only 61, though. They get it from the start, so that's plus 60 area, at least. Hey, my other arcana. I'm just gonna get awake, because, well, those final waves are scary. I've once again not put up anything close to when I should. You go bye-bye. I didn't get the pierce right. Well, I'm out. God. It's so much pierce. Holy crap. Area. 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 Area? Area. Area. Uh, wait, no, I can't do it. Oh, hey, it's a regular vacuum. Boy, I should not be doing any of this. I should just put it on random always. Bye-bye, oh, Genevieve. Your evil will be remembered as destroyed by the spread gun. This card, ew. Oh wow, that did a lot of damage. All right, I got about nine minutes to jibber jabber about nothing. Random always. Let's make this go as fast as possible. Jibber jabber, jabber jibber. Vampire survivors. Now how deep down is Minna on the chart? Thirty-one out of eighty something, though I do have twelve down, so I'm about halfway through the list at this point. Halfway through the third wave. Boy, howdy is my plan for the fourth wave to give you the only thing that's gonna keep me going. That one's gonna be very silly. Yeah. <laughs> 
Anyone just needs some prep work. I don't really need to... Wait, no, I need way more than I thought I did, don't I? Uh-oh. I mean, time-wise, it shouldn't take up that much more. Yeah, it's just one more level to a video. Right, right, right. It won't add much, especially if I take a smaller stage. Oh, the bigger problem would be just making sure I can set it up correctly. Oh well, that's only a couple hundred dollars down the drain. Well, no. It would be nice to have a backup just in case. Hey, maybe I can order, like, a specialty thing. That would be nice. That would be nice. Where was I going again? Oh, yeah. Minna. Everything's dying. Huh. What's with the weird... fade on the whip there? Oh, right, because you got that after-effect image. I've got enough duration that that's lasting longer than it should. Look at all them shots firing out. It's silly how big those spread guns are. <laughs> that would be even sillier if I was on a character that could really get it going. Wait, I'm already past the Yavana and such, aren't I? Yeah, they were up higher. Huh. Wait, why did it take... Right, right. Moonspell was last video, but Minra had already taken out Lake Foscari, so over to Abyss here. Yeah, that's what happened. That's clearly what happened. Yes, I actually remember to check out my chart ahead of time. Yay, I'm beginning to stabilize. Man, them spread gun shots are huge. Yeesh, all that pierce is really ripping them up, huh? Yeah, even the bosses at 20 minutes aren't standing up for that long. Now imagine if I had my bouncy bullets or hard to fire bullets, it would be even more absurd. Yeah, spread guns in prototype C's definitely got the best all arounder package. It's not as, say, useless as diver mines well redeeming itself entirely on a tama torpedo like that set wasn't well, that just kind of worthless entirely like short gun and then it just gets slightly less worthless with its prototype like short gun and prototype b it's just a strong all-arounder and it evolves with empty tone so there's no real negative to getting it get yourself a weapon power up and i'll get you a free revive So, at this level, they aren't even doing that, like, segmented movement, that jank movement anymore. Bye-bye, boss skull thing. I don't know what the name of the skulls on the ball of meat is. Do you? That's my call to action for this video. Blah, blah, blah. And that's really for a non 
game and things like seriously what are you supposed to do i mean maybe if you're doing some sort of way, you could choose your own adventure but that would be well i guess i could do that but no You bang bang. Uh oh, bigger, scarier wave coming in. Probably, but they can't stand up against this much area going on. Look at all them big old spread shots. Because I have so much pierce, it's actually getting through and doing damage to many targets. I'm not getting to the end of the screen, though. Jeez. Man, all those pierce levels were crazy. Unlike this, pierce is so effective for boosting up its overall damage and DPS. It's going to be a pretty high number, all things considering. Or at least I hope it does. I sure hope it does. Taking the biggest spread gun shots here. Well, technically I could have gone bigger with... Well, Mina. Mina could go the biggest with everything. Five per level? Not matching that with anyone ever. At this point, she would basically be maxed out. Especially if I had Boogaloo on the back end. Six per level? Crazy. Huh? Oh, surviving. Well, I can just create corridors to walk down if the terrain actually remotely was... Oh, hey, we're all over again. Oh. Yeah, I can just corridor this between the two weapons. They don't stand a chance. Good thing I'm not on inverse or anything deadly like that. Oh, wow. Not even here, though. Their sheer size works against me. Boy, they're big. Dang, Leda clones. Go back to the shit of the earth tree where you belong. And engage in whatever tomfoolery and nonsense is going to lead to you attacking me. Because you're an NPC in a FromSoft game. You either die or attack me. Usually both. That. Oh, wow. Go beaver power. Alrighty. Mina is gonna be taking on the bone zone. With healing, it should be no problem as long as I don't accidentally get Tarona's box maxed out again by running over a chest when I'm at nine or eight. Yep, that sure happened. No dissing any Atlanteans this time either. I'm just sitting here next to my buddy the merchant and surviving. Who needs something that actually won't be all that helpful anyway? Alright, gotta keep moving. So retain your momentum. Then your power ups, you just need to be careful. Boy, should I just be grabbing Empty Tomb first, though? Gotta get those attacks up as fast as possible. More attacks means more healing, which means more safety. And the more I move, the more Vento Sacro increases its damage. Which is not helpful in the least, really, but... Hey, it's... something. Uh, Ro Nuz box Can't stop it, won't stop it. Except at 8. You don't get that 100% curse when it maxes out and it kills you. 
like it just did. As it turns out, the Atlanteans are very fast at 150% curse. And the skeletons are well not one-shotting. Really annoying. Oh, Vento Secro, you do no damage. Dang, I was hoping for a big red gem. Haven't killed enough, it seems. Or unkilled enough, as they are skeletons. Wow, farming gems means I should get levels at a decent clip. That's eight. Do not get the chest. That's Banish Town. And now I have to stay still and hope I survive. Well, I evolve. Ten minutes in. Yeah, that's not happening. The beauty of silence. That way you don't have to listen to my weird dang voice. Boy how do you think after literally hundreds of hours of doing video I'd be better at speaking and doing things but nope. Same curse that has plagued me since birth. I don't get better. I just get worse the more I do things. It must be nice to be able to improve yourself. I wouldn't know. I've been bad since birth. Bad to the bone, da 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 da. Bad, da 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 da. Bad to the bone, da 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 da. They are very frail. They break constantly. I am in constant agony. Not because of the bones breaking. Just in general. Oh god, life is pain. It hurts. It hurts. 115 views. I've got more episodes of the Beswick out than that. Oh no, I'm a terrible content creator. And hey, that's on me. I don't blame people for not subscribing. That means I just wasn't entertaining enough. I can't get that catch in right away to catch their eye, even with adding essentially the weird preview to start. Well, I guess it's been slightly better. I don't know, has been adding the little preview of the start caught your attention more or something? Let me know in the comments down below. All to action. Wow, that bullet hit me like multiple times. Can't get down. Here we go. Man, not being able to evolve early is troublesome. Man, it would be nice to have saved... Well, not that this is a... Actually, map NFT that I could save. This is just a Fire Breath random event. Man, it would be nice to save for the boss. Wow, that's a ton of area. As Boogaloo and Mina's just coincided to be at their max. Inner Stalker. Oh, I'm not taking these out in one hit. That's bad. Okay, boss is down there, which means it's not getting hit at all. Stalker I means I am not going to get hit at all. Good grief, it's so hard to actually tell where it is. Now, the smart thing would be to wait until the Stalker has left me before I focus on the boss. 
But if there's one thing about the Beswick that we have learned, it's that I am not smart, skilled, or intelligent. Which goes to show that I just used two cinnamons to mean the main saying a thing in one description. Well, you're kind of worthless. I can't evolve you. Can't evolve you. Hard shot it is. I don't even mean to do this intentionally, it just keeps sort of happening, because that's how things shake out. Random always, I don't care. Oh, bye, Stalker. Give me my silent old sanctuary. Let me become untouchable underneath the stars. Mine will be an age of stars. Wait. So what did Ronnie do with her great room? Did she never grab one? I can't remember. I mean, she must not have. It never comes up. And there's gotta be more than just the ones we see. And acquire. Yeah, obviously we don't acquire Mikkels and we know he has one. Well, we should be greeting it from the DLC anyway. Base game's been out for two years. Spoilers! No, but it wasn't with... Huh. Turns out it's so much easier when you don't accidentally hit Torona's box up to max. Oh, hey, candy box. Mmm, delicious candy. Jolly Rancher to my stomach. Down my throat, make it nice and sugary. Not projectile speed this time. Not so much in other things. Boy, that area is dumpstered. Well, that's mean as randomness for you. Probably should have gone a more random set build, considering. But, hey. It's here and we're a burning. Come on, YouTube, I'm plenty consistent. If you give me a reach, then I will definitely get some engagement. Why? Why? I don't think that's the problem. If the algorithm suddenly decides to not give you a reach, you aren't going to get any views. Randomly decides to give me a ton of reach on the spread gun videos, and I get an okay number of views. Not that many likes, all things considered. Which is probably the real problem. I'm just not an entertaining person. And yet I want to play video games for a living. Rather than do whatever it is that I do. Oh. Oh, candy box. That would have been eight weapons. Nine once the Super Candy Box 2 Turbo comes out to play like a warrior. How many people are even going to get that? 
Warriors come out to play. Man, I want a Coney Island. Hey, I'm Wilson. Oh, hello, Drowner. How's it going? You drowning things? That's bad. Don't drown things. Like... Oh my god, you're drowning puppies. You're the worst. You're the most evil of them all. Uh oh, damage. Let's fix that. Oh, explodey boys. Ah, yes. The giant wave of exploding trickster stuff. Clearly what I needed. More than anything. Really do hope we get a Reaper variant. Well, well. Drowners are really... Well, I guess no. If we get trickster staff, you could fire out gems like it's game killer and still get the XP for them. That would be an interesting weapon, right? Well, if I'm a healing, clearly I want to be awake. Oh man, I forgot. I always forget this one goes on so long. That makes this video quite a bit longer than the others. So they got two major stages and whatever my bonus is going to be it's probably going to be very short hopefully it should be very short but i want it to be very short i want to get two videos recorded today and then again i want a lot of things like you know people to pay back the money they owe me but why would that happen when Spike can instead roll the day? I really shouldn't be talking about that, but whatever. Man, those dank flowers are so durable. Their HP times level for whatever reason. Not even that high of a level. Man, you almost forget just how weak things are when you're outside inverse mode. Like, this would not have gone through at all on inverse, even if I had the other Archon from the start. 100 damage? 50 damage? I'd have been a j weird werewolfy corpse. Well, no. It's a... Horse? I can't remember. I know it's one of those weird name doesn't mean what it means. Huh. Wow. That's a lot of lag for some reason. That's weird. Wouldn't be this much lag. It's, oh. Okay, yeah, Mina is just super slow by default, but still, there is definitely lag going on too. You can feel it in the movement. It's weird. Oh, what? Are you actually weaker than the ones before you? Man, not having all that pierce causes issues, huh? At least I got a nice character that could chew through bones with no issues. Granted, without inverse buffing up their HP, a lot of characters can chew it through with less issues. But I don't have to prepare for fourth wave till way later. And should I prepare for it now? Hmm, DQ Blizzard. You see, in my mind, all these topics totally link together. But I'm not projecting them in an audible fashion. So it just comes across as random nonsense. I mean, is it? Well, I don't know what time they open. I mean... Do they even... I mean, obviously, they're Dairy Queen as soon as they open their presenting ice cream. 
But do I really have the time for that? Well, not with waking up an hour late again. Anyway, there's Minwa. Minwa? I don't know, this isn't Final Fantasy 2. Oh, man, Mina. You're heading to Space 54. What could you possibly do in space? Could you make the biggest of Boogaloo's of illusions? Well, actually, I should go down to get the empty tome ASAP. Huh, both my things are on the map, huh? <laughs> I mean, going too far down is pointless, but... Oh, I might as well... Dang, bats. Get down here and die. I mean, one is doable. Anything more than that's just sort of a... Very, very long waste of time. As I will keep repeating over and over and over again. Oh, there's my Vento Sacro. That Sacro sure got vented. Hello there, empty tome. Boy, you're surviving. No hits at all, wow. You are sure HP times level. Wow, that was a huge boost. They must have synced up again. Here's their double random for you. Oh man, it's so many chickens. The evolution stat here. That shouldn't do it right. Plenty of time to check it, because I got all the time in space. Hey, a vacuum. A vacuum in space? Who could have foreseen that? In Labrador. I should not have gotten Can Labrador. I should have gotten Vento Sacro. There's Vento Sacro again, and again. What are we gonna do with all this Vento and all this Sacro? Yeah. Man, they spawn in so strangely here. Oh, right, maxed out Candle Labrador, so I don't actually need to go up anymore, because it's gone. Let me break the bounds of my body. Break into space. Show the world that you, too, can randomly change all your attributes at will. All against your will. All I'm saying is, will is... A green thing. You sure they've just updated Courage by now? Oh well. Oh hey, a chest. That could have ended poorly. No. Yes, 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 it could have ended poorly. But it didn't. Yay, not being poorly done. You know, that somehow feels like an Earthbound reference, but I don't think I've seen in any Earthbound references otherwise in this game. Because that's just sort of the random geometry I could totally fit in our Earth. What? How much damage do you do? Holy crap, what? Nope, oh, did I miss an old sanctuary? 
No, it was at the very end. That silent old sanctuary. You know it. You love it. The best arcana in the game. You know, if I'm gonna have a choice. Again. Why do you keep spying? I just keep getting that bad random event? I don't think you're natural to hear. This is all aliens and ducks. Might as well be aliens. Hmm. Zippity doo da. Zippity day. Again, with these dang skelly waves. What is going on? They have to be from random events, right? Walla foo waloo. How do you do? I hope you have a good day and that you'll keep messing around in the future. Perhaps you'll even like, dislike, comment, or subscribe. Because I'm a soulless hack who has to say those things other than let it occur naturally. I'm a hack. Other people do aren't hacks. They have quality content they can share. I just play video games badly. Like, man, watching people just... Skillfully eventually learn and beat the Shallier Tree bosses while I'm just here throwing on my spirit ashes and still whining like the child I am deep down. Granted, I still won't stop thinking some of the bosses are garbage. Because, good golly, give me a time to attack. I get one swing for every ten years, what's the point? Learn the patterns? Okay, I dodge 18 times in a row, get one hit in. God help me if I get hit at some point, because then I don't get a hit in, because I have to heal. Oh no, I'm complaining about other games again. I should go back to playing some Holo Cure. Can't complain about Holo Cure. That's just me being bad. Probably why. Really? Oh, right. Well, I have a revive, but I'm tired. And this is close to being needed to be posted again. Yay, waking up late. You're maxed. Oh, you're maxed with a bunch of levels. Mm-hmm, these are all a bunch of nice weapons. Okay, I'm gonna wait till I get... Mm, before I grab the Golden Favorite, I'm gonna wait till things get the nice big... Well, actually, no, this is the best time to do it. Because these split, so they show up a lot more. Yeah, got the cosmic finger. Woohoo, profusion damoi. It's still in line because I only got three weapons. Please ignore all my other rules. Because if I get an animal off the character that's an 8-2, boy am I gonna use it. Not like it matters if you get it by that point. You've already won. You can clearly do enough damage to pierce through the heavens. Somewhat literally in this case. Oh, there's, it's really hard to put out the weird uh, spot out spot out the weird image that would show up behind our soul here. Dang you, Fawaf Wallow. I can definitely tell it's there, but it's all dark blue against black. Well, I guess against the cosmic sky. Ox. 
I mean, there's plenty of black, but there's also plenty of purple. But it's really hard to spot out the steel stalker, really. And that's why I get a awake, even though I have another revive because of the weapon thing. He's going to catch me out of nowhere again. Wait, there should be a rosary around here. Boy, I can't find it, though. It's definitely off to the left somewhere. Dang it. It's not showing up. For me to grab it. And deal with this stalker once and for all. I mean, we're Logan, no issue. Okay, it's past the minute, so Stalker should be gone by now. Right, let's see if I can get over to gold or Golden Finger in the uh, minute I have to go. Sure doesn't double your movement speed. Sure doesn't do that. Man, Pierce would just be really helpful here. Oh, well, I can't get through this. All I can do is stay still, clutch my knees, and not cry. Plenty of power ups, though. Or plenty of pickups, though. Like that dang rosary right there. Oh, a burning tornado. Go than the might of the NFT. Dollars on the pound. Dollars on the pound. Oh, death. Stage completed. Yay. That's Minna taking us down. Three more on the Beswick. Thanks for watching. And Mina has taken us up. 347. 348. And over here, 349 on the Beswick. Almost halfway. To 400 on the 300s. Yay! And that will leave us with a grand total of 1,583 more to go. Oh god, there's so many more still. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed enough to leave a like, dislike, comment, or subscription. Either way, I hope you have a good day and you keep messing around in Vampire Survivor's Beswick.